we are eating the genetically modified food, we get many advantages like the food products are very cheap in price and also it is easily available at various shops. If I talk about the disadvantages of genetically modified food, then the quality of the food is not the original quality, but it is the good quality that is done by the pesticides, chemical, fertilizers and other things. So, I think that we should avoid the use of genetically modified food because when the people are consuming such kind of food, it is negatively affecting the health of the people and also the genetically modified food is not good for our health. So, we should always eat the food that is the natural and organically grown food crops. In this image, I can see that there is a photo of a person and especially the face of that person is very large in size and it looks like the person showing that he is very surprised or he is very amazed because of something. The one lady is seen walking on the street and she is holding the handbag with her and it looks like she is, she is seeing on the floor and walking on the road. I feel that the, the image is captured with a black and white camera and no colors are seen in the image. The person or the face that is seen in the image, the, the hair of the person really very long and also the beard and the moustache are also dark black in color and they are also long hair. I feel that it is the uh, it is the office front or the shop of the of uh, shop of the barber or a haircut shop and also the road scene over there is very neat and clean and a wall of white color is seen over there situations when we have to please the other person or the convince the other person Many times I have pleased or convinced some of my family members but I feel that a special situation when I pleased my father was on his birthday. Generally my father is a very simple and a normal person and he do not like to spend money on unnecessary things like birthday celebration, anniversary or other things. But on his 40th birthday, I pleased him to celebrate his birthday in a special way and we decided to do the charity on his birthday. I feel that initially he was not agreeing for that thing. But after I told him all the things and how I would feel after doing that thing, he was convinced and agreed for that. Initially, I told him that it is my feeling that I want to celebrate your birthday on a special way and I was successful in pleasing him because he is also a charity lover and he also want to do charity. There are many family members whom I closely admire. And I feel that we always admire the people whom we personally like or whom we are very close to. But one old person whom I very personally admire is my grandfather. My grandfather is really a very good person and he was a teacher. I feel that my grandfather is a very young, very good person and he is really a very hard working person. He believes that 
we should always do hard work in our life and we should always work for the good things he also told me that we should never cheat with the people and he has given me many good habits in my life so i very personally and closely admire my grandfather because my grandfather is a very reputed and a respected person in my village so i feel that it is a very good a person to be admired and i admired him since my childhood and even today i admire my grandfather very closely hath ki bolu we all know that we all know that our priorities keep on changing and many times it happens that some things that are not important to us in our life earlier but once the time changes it becomes important for us one such thing that i would like to mention here that was not important to me earlier was about my future plans before 5 years i was not very young person and i was around the age of 14 to 15 years and i was not enough matured that time so i was spending majority of my time in studying and playing with my friends and family members but now i feel that it is really important to think about our future and we should always plan the things in a good way i feel that future planning is really very important to become successful because if we are prepared for our future and if we are having everything clear in our mind then we can work accordingly and become successful in life i feel that future planning was not important 5 years ago because when i was young before 5 years i was not enough matured to think about the future and i was only uh, i was only busy in playing the games like video game or visiting friends or going to restaurant and other places with my friends and family members and at the age of 15 or 16 we are not having any financial responsibility or any other things so we are not much worried about the future because at that time we are using the money of our parents but after a particular age we become enough matured and we start spending the money that we are earning by ourselves so we should always think that what we are doing and what things we should do in our future so it is every time it everything has a proper age and at that age we automatically start doing that thing so i feel that i was young at 5 years ago but now i am enough matured to think about my future हाथ की बोली